Hey, what's up, guys? This is Akshay from AS Learning, and today in this video, we will be seeing about U.com. Okay, so uh, uh, U.com is built on top of Chat GPT, and it uses Microsoft Bing APIs. Okay, a uh, few days back, there was a, a quite a topic where people were comparing Chat GPT with uh, Google search and uh, many articles, many blogs were written and most of them favored that chat GPT is just an LLM. It is not connected to internet. You cannot find many things via chat GPT, which you can get via Google search. Okay. But still uh, chat GPT impacted uh, a lot and many of the results by chat GPT were very good. Okay. Now, <laughs> U.com gets created on top of Chat GPT and Microsoft Bing APIs. Now, you with the help of Chat GPT, you can search online. Okay, so today in this video, we'll be seeing about uh, U.com and we'll be um, seeing it's uh, like does it really work good? Okay, so let me do a simple search. Okay. Uh, let's say India versus Sri Lanka. Okay. Yesterday's match was really heartbroken. Okay. So we got some searches. Okay. Uh, we got a search from news sports ndtv.com first post.com. Okay. We have a carousal like structure where we can see shots also. Okay. Nice. Nice. And here uh, you have another tile like structure, then you have news articles. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Now, after that, uh, what we'll be seeing is, uh, okay, you have this simple addition also. This is very cool. Let's say uh, if I say live, so it will tell me uh, live cricket match going on. Okay. So some simple addition to the search is nice. Then uh, you have a feature of chats, okay, where you can chat. I think this is very much similar to the way chat GPT works. You give some input and it responds back its output very much similar to chat GPT. It is currently in beta. Okay, accuracy might be limited. Okay, then you're getting the images the way you get the uh, Google images. Okay, you have the videos. Let me see the links of images. Okay, images, it is coming from every website. Okay, fine. Then you have your videos. I'm expecting a lot of YouTube videos. Okay, most of them are from YouTube. Only one I can see from Facebook and Daily Motion. Okay, but most of them are from YouTube. Okay, then you have news. Okay, you're getting the news and you're getting the maps also. Okay, which map is it using? Is it Google Maps? Oh, okay, okay, fine. It is redirecting to the Google map only. Interesting. Okay, great. Fine. So all the basics feature which we see in uh, Google search. So they all are there. You get your images, videos, uh, news and maps also. And in fact, it uses Google's ape. Uh, Google's API only for maps. Okay, so Google must be getting paid. Okay, then uh, we have a write for me. Okay, nice. You can choose your use case whether you want to write an email, paragraph, social media post. Okay, great. Let me do one thing. I'll create a blog. You can select a tone also. Fine. I'll create professional. Then audience. Uh, okay, it's optional. Fine. Let me write a blog about uh, u.com versus uh, Google search. Okay, let's write blog on this only. Okay, it is writing. Okay, this gives me a feel of uh, the Gradio UX, which we generally see. Uh, okay, you got the blog also now. Okay, when it comes to online search, there are two main contenders. Oh, guy, they have already claimed there are two main contenders. U.com and Google search Microsoft binge in the site. Both of them services offer powerful tools and this and that. U.com offers this. Okay, good blog. I mean, like a short generated text and very meaningful and on the point text. Okay, so this is very nice. You can, you can literally write blogs, essays, titles, social media posts, paragraphs, emails also. This is beautiful, beautiful. And I think here uh, they have kept a restriction also. 
they have only kept 10 free writings i guess after 10 they might be charging you okay okay fine fine nice but this is nice this is more accessible actually many people don't uh, many people will have to create a chat gpt login and then go there but yeah you.com i think many people will start using this feature a lot and this is a very good earning source also if this gets paid then here you have code generation okay why did i got this is this a wrong this is some wrong uh, redirecting which is happening okay right they are pointing it on the right side on code it is again giving me on the search result only this might be some bug or i'm not sure why this is happening okay imagine they have redirected me to a right place code let me try again okay it is some issue is there with the code okay then imagine this is something like stable diffusion you parse some text and it will generate an ai image for you okay so let me pass the text of uh, penguin on uh, seashore okay let me see if it my spelling is wrong penguin on seashore okay let's see what it generates it is giving okay here we have something called a lexica also lexical stable diffusion ai search engine okay cool <coughs> i don't know what lexica is maybe this is some another search engine which is built on stable diffusion model can be a case okay then we have study social okay fine you look at it just look at it uh, you wanted penguin on seashore it gave you penguin on seashore and you can download the image now then we have study uh, let's see what they offer in study uh, i think it is somewhat similar to search only here you have something called as quizlet i think they are giving you some quizzes okay fine then let's see what's in social in social you are being redirected to twitter facebook linkedin okay cool fine and you have shop also there you can shop things also i think it, it is almost pretty much everything which google offers to us and also extra like you don't have write and imagine and code in google separate tags but they are being offered by you.com so pretty much everything which google offers us i hope so they are free uh, u.com a dozen charges but it seems like they will be start they will start charging things because this is very at ease it makes you at ease okay so this i put into code mode this is the same uh, of writing and this is the imagine this is what we were expecting on writing the code but there seems to be some kind of issue in the code there of redirecting it has given some samples so let me try audio chunking algorithm okay and it is redirecting me to stack overflow links and other links also like spring uh, springer links also okay here you have something called as u code ai hugging face okay fine let me see if it generates the code okay <laughs> this is crazy shit happening here Okay. it has just given me one pipeline okay. only this much chunk pipeline tokenizer model dot this i was expecting more okay, let's be uh, more clarifying um, let me put uh, training random forest uh, using python okay, let's see what it gives okay this seems to be fishy now okay this is wrong code this is wrong this is entirely wrong what is trainer model example this is wrong i think they will improve with time i i have seen better results on chat gpt uh giving such text prompts i'm not sure why this is being generated but this is not good okay but yeah uh, it is just launched and uh, okay here you have other things also you get many apps also okay 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 cool 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 okay i think the way we have chrome extensions these guys have apps 
here also you can do a lot of 150 exploring apps oh, okay this is their own marketplace now oh my god they have literally created a competitor for google this is crazy i think happening here nice let's see uh, what is geek for geeks uh, what is this code uh, discover mm, i'm not sure i think these are the apps they're using it is not giving me the option to use it you can just rate it up start these are popular apps newest apps and what is code now what should i make sense are these links but you they are not redirecting me also okay let's try another one SQL code AI newest app how should I download it if I want to download maybe I'll have to do a login and do it can be a case okay but still I, I feel that this is a good competitor to Google and uh, they have some X factors which Google does not have like straight away they are giving you a template to write and thing to create images i think they are charging also after a certain limit they will start charging and straight away this product will start spinning the money i'll just say a new competitor is born great fine that's it with this guys if you like this video stay tuned to as check other videos also and uh, take care peace out